Health departments are out in full force trying to get ahead of this year's mosquito season. Mosquito control officials in Marion and Hamilton counties say that peak season for mosquitoes is just a few weeks away now. CBS 4's Bianca Reyes gives us a glimpse on how each county traps, tests, and treats mosquitoes and the health benefits behind it. The saying goes, the early bird gets the worm. But when it comes to mosquito control, taking a sample to see if we can find any larva, the early bird gets the larva. Here's what they look like when they're in the dipper. We get out early to prevent the mosquitoes from hatching, which in turn prevents disease transmission. Keeping mosquitoes at bay is a matter of public health. In Hamilton County, traps are set in 35 different locations countywide to collect samples of standing water and test for mosquito borne illnesses. We're probably coming up on a peak as far as the uh, West Nile virus is concerned. We Alex Davis says sample collections like these start testing positive for West Nile virus closer to July when it's hotter and more humid. That's why his crew is out early, coating standing water with larvicide, a mineral oil that evaporates in 24 hours under the sun's UV rays. The oil just puts a covering over the water so they can't breathe and it suffocates them. Once mosquitoes emerge into biting flying adults, you're really limited in what you can do. Matt Sinsko says fogging is the only way to knock down adult mosquitoes. Health officials say there are more than 35 different species in Marion County alone. We're not having a huge volume of mosquitoes right now, but there's still a lot of mosquitoes out there, and including the type of mosquito that does transmit West Nile virus. Health officials say so far it's been a relatively dry season, which means mosquito levels are average for now. Things can change quickly. Um, all it really takes is one major rainfall to kind of turn the tables. Reporting in Westfield, I'm Bianca Reyes, CBS 4 News. Thank you. And county health officials say that Hoosiers can take action now to reduce the risk of mosquitoes in their own backyard. They say anything that can hold water has the potential to breed mosquitoes, and they're urging Hoosiers to take five minutes just to unclog your gutters, empty your bird bath, and remove kiddie pools when they are not in use.